Welcome to our training, Manage Your FBA Inventory. After watching this video, you'll be able to use features on the FBA Inventory Management page in Seller Central and maintain FBA inventory after shipping your products to a fulfillment center. Maintaining your FBA inventory is crucial. If you run out of inventory for a given product, the listing for that product will automatically be inactivated. This will negatively impact your sales and sales velocity, and may also impact your search ranking. You also may incur long-term storage fees, which are costlier than standard storage fees, if your inventory is poorly managed or if you store excess inventory for too long. To help you ensure that your FBA inventory is current, let's explore how to use the FBA Inventory Management page in Seller Central. First, click the menu icon in the top left corner of the Seller Central homepage. Hover over Inventory and click FBA Inventory. You'll be taken to your FBA Inventory Management page. On this page, you can view your current FBA products and check the number of products that are either available, inbound, reserved, or unfulfillable. Note that the page will reflect when your products actually arrive at a fulfillment center. Before you ship your products, make sure to consider how long they'll take to arrive at the fulfillment center. We recommend that you have about two months of inventory on hand at fulfillment centers at any given time. Remember to check your inventory frequently. If your unit level is zero, your listing will become inactive. Also, if you set inventory replenishment alerts, you'll see a red bell next to the number in the available column representing the stock that's low at the fulfillment center. To set replenishment alerts or to view more features, click the edit listing button. Here are two other things to consider when maintaining your FBA inventory. First, you might benefit from high stock limits. These limits reduce the number of times you have to send your products to fulfillment centers. The higher your sell-through rate, the more these limits will increase. Strategies such as running ads and deals can help you promote your products and may increase both your sales and your stock limits. Also, ensure that you don't have inventory sitting in fulfillment centers for long periods of time, as this may negatively impact your sell-through rate. Second, make sure to always check that your inventory is kept at an adequate level and that you're aware of any low stock alerts. Let's review the best practices for maintaining FBA inventory. Check your inventory frequently on the FBA Inventory Management page. Set replenishment alerts. Have approximately two months of inventory at fulfillment centers. Increase your stock limits using marketing and promotions. Send products you know will sell. This concludes our video on managing your FBA inventory. Thank you and happy selling in the Amazon store.